Hi everyone, welcome to Life Tips by Ning. Today's video is a case study for young wood born in fall and how to analyze their favorable element. So let's look at the first example of this young wood person born in August. So that's Shen meaning August for our um, uh, birth month. So their yearly pillar is a young fire and a young fire. And the monthly pillar is a young fire and young metal. The daily pillar is a young wood and young wood. And the hourly pillar is a yin fire and the yin wood. So the first step of analyzing this Bazi chart is what's the condition of the daily master? Am I in a balanced state? Am I too strong or too weak? So in this case, um, it's sitting, the root is sitting in is same as myself. So it has a strong root already. And then position, position number eight is another wood, in wood sitting. So it's already having like a good rooting system. So I wouldn't call this a too weak of a buzz chart. Maybe it's a little weaker, but it's fairly in that balanced zone. And what's also going to support wood is water right water supports wood but this chart doesn't have any water in it so i can say that okay it's a fairly balanced maybe a little weaker um daily master and then so in that case we following the logic from last episode i do want that trimming of my overgrown tree so do i have that sharpened blade to trim my tree um in this case, you have this young metal sitting here. That's a good blade to work with. But what is the illness or disease for this chart? The unbalanced energy is too much fire. So you have one here, one here, one here, one here, four of them. And especially two of them are sitting right next to the daily master. So um, the, 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 problem with this example is there's too much fire so that's an illness or disease so how do i have this medicine to make it into a more balanced state so this fire is not over killing this metal i really need to trim my my tree branches that's why um technically because this fire is so strong water is not effective enough it can actually make this overgrown fire angry and reverse suppressing water that's why we need earth earth would be the medicine for this example because fire grows earth so earth will reduce this energy of fire and earth also grows metal so earth can support this weakened metal to make it effective and useful again so unfortunately this buzz doesn't have the medicine it's in its own chart i don't see earth anywhere then it's very important to watch out for that earth element in either the annual or the 10 year environmental influence so we can see okay this moment in your life you have this medicine to cure your imbalance and that's when you should make important decisions because you have a higher chance of being successful uh, moving on to the second example um, this is a young wood person born in Yo, which is um, September. So the a yearly pillar is a yang metal and the yang wood, and the monthly pillar is a yin wood and yin metal. The daily pillar is a yang wood and yang water, and the hourly pillar is a yin fire and yin wood. So same logic, right? What is my the state of my own daily master? Um, I'm watching, I'm looking for wood or water that makes me strong. So you have, looking at the bottom first, I'm sitting on the water by myself. And then I have a wood, I have another wood. It's a very good, strong rooting system. And then I also have a neighbor on top supporting me. So it's in a fairly balanced state, but in comparison to this prior example, it's more um, indexing over that strong and not the weaker end. So it's a little like maybe a little too strong, but not to the extreme state. It's still fairly balanced. And then in that case, I definitely need trimming to preserve my energy. 
So as I mentioned in the prior um, video, you want that sharpened blade. So in fire and young metal working together to trim my tree. And look at this chart. It has this young metal here and in fire here. And they're actually working in conjunction beautifully because this metal not only have this fire to sharpen it, it also has a root in this monthly position to support it. So it's a fairly strong and useful cutting tool to trim the overgrown tree. So this is a very good basil chart. It's actually an example of like a highest ranking government official in the old times, like position number one supporting the emperor. Because in its own chart, it doesn't have super unbalanced disease or illness. And he has the favorable element already appearing to keep his own wood in a balanced state. So it's less reliant on this annual 10 year trend to introduce medicine. Uh, last example is this um, young wood born in October. She does the uh, month pillar. So the yearly pillar is uh, yin earth and yin earth. Uh, the monthly pillar is young wood and young earth. The daily pillar is a yang wood and yang water, and it's the same hourly pillar of yang wood and yang water. Remember last episode, I was saying this transitional earth month of October, it's higher demand. It needs that water, fire, metal to all come in to keep it in a very um, balanced environmental climate. And fortunately, this person, you can already see, is fairly lacking certain elements. So um, same logic, right? Do I have wood and water supporting me? Look at this, like wood, wood, water, water. Like the, the, the three most powerful positions, like two, four, and seven closest to me, they're all supporting me. And then I have this position number eight supporting me. That makes me a little too much too strong and i in that case i especially crave this fire and metal working together to trip me but unfortunately all the remaining elements are earth this person has no um fire or metal earth works because it's still that on the reduction side of that seesaw to um because water and wood make myself strong and because wood suppresses earth, earth still makes myself weaker. So it kind of helps to keep that seesaw balanced. However, um, earth is not the right medicine. It's like a secondary medicine. Great, it works, but it doesn't have the most effective treatment in comparison to uh, fire and metal cutting me to keep me in balance so this person is just like an ordinary person because remember the 10 spirit earth a wood suppresses earth the the spirit i suppress meaning, meaning the merchant spirit so this person end up like making a lot of money is more like a business person but it's a female life so remember the 10 spirit what is it lacking it doesn't have any metal controlling wood Metal is that um, official, that uh, discipliner spirit equating to a female's husband or spouse. And it also doesn't have that element of fire. Fire is the wood grows and supports fire. So fire is the equivalent of this um, expressor uh, spirit that also is a, sig signifies my, my child is the the element I support and grow. So since it's missing both that metal and fire element in, it, in its original chart, that's why this person is less likely to have a family life, like getting married or having a child. You really have to wait for a strong annual 10 year trend with fire and metal energy to make that happen. So you can see it's a fairly alone life. I don't know if she feels lonely or not, but definitely more alone by herself the whole life story is about making money, that merchant spirit. So that's the, the kind of the storytelling we can see from lacking and missing major element in the Bazi chart and that how it shows up in a person's real life.
So hopefully um, this is a good case study showing you how to analyze your chart. And I really want to encourage people to have more interest and in, because this Chinese stuff is super useful in our own life. I know it's quite complicated, but stick with it and use comments if you have questions. I'll try my best to answer and explain questions um, on a weekly basis. Um, my whole goal is to share this traditional Chinese wisdom so more people can benefit from it. And thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.